Hi, kids! Now we know what's multiplication and multiplying a single digit or double digit number with a single digit number. Today we will learn multiplying a double digit or a bigger number with a double digit number. So let's get started. We will multiply 34 multiplied by 21. Remember, order of numbers does not change the product. That is, 34 multiplied by 21 equals 21 multiplied by 34. In any sum addition, subtraction, or multiplication, we first align the numbers. Now, first multiply 21 with the ones digit of 34. 4 multiplied by 1 equals 4. Write 4 in the product at 1's place. 4 multiplied by 2 equals 8. Write 8 in the product at 10's place. Now, put a multiplication sign below the 1's place digit of product. Now, multiply 21 with 10's digit, that is 3. 3 multiplied by 1 equals 3. Write 3 in product at 10's place. 3 multiplied by 2 equals 6. Write 6 in product at 100's place. Now, we have multiplied 21 with both the digits of 34. Now add the products. 4 plus 0 equals 4. 8 plus 3 equals 11. Carry over 1 to next place. 6 plus 1 carry equals 7. 714 is our product of 21 and 34. This is called column method of multiplication. We will see many examples of our practice. So let's see another example. There are 421 houses in the town and there are 34 windows in each house. How many windows are there in total in the town? We will multiply 421 multiplied by 34. Remember, order of numbers does not change the product. That is, 421 multiplied by 34 equals 34 multiplied by 421. In any sum addition, subtraction, or multiplication, we first align the numbers. Now, first multiply 461 with the ones digit of 34. 4 multiplied by 1 equals 4. Write 4 in product at 1's place. 4 multiplied by 2 equals 8. Write 8 in product at 10's place. 4 multiplied by 4 equals 16. Write 16 in the product. Now put a multiplication sign below the ones place digit of product. Now multiply 421 with tens digit, that is 3. 3 multiplied by 1 equals 3. Write 3 in product starting at tens place. 3 multiplied by 2 equals 6. Write 6 in product at hundreds place. 3 multiplied by 4 equals 12. Write 12 in the product at next place. Now we have multiplied 421 with both the digits of 34. Now add the product. 4 plus 0 equals 4. 8 plus 3 
equals 11. Carry over 1 to next place. 6 plus 6 plus 1 carry equals 13. Write 3 in the sum and carry over 1 to next place. 1 plus 1 plus 2 equals 4. Write 4 in the sum. Nothing to add in 1. Write 1 in the sum. 14,314 is our product of 421 multiplied by 34. This is called column method of multiplication. So let's see another example. There are 550 boxes and 78 balls are there in each box. How many balls are there in total? 550 multiplied by 78. First of all, align the numbers. Now multiply 550 with one's digit of 78, that is 8. 8 multiplied by 0 equals 0. Anything multiplied with 0 is 0. 8 multiplied by 5 equals 40. Write 0 in the product and carry over 4. As we always carry over 10's place, and keep the ones place in sum or product. Now, put a multiplication sign below the ones place digit of the product. Now, multiply 550 with tens digit of 78. That is 7. 7 multiplied by 0 equals 0. Write 0 in the product starting from tens place. 7 multiplied by 5 equals 35. So write ones place, that is, 5 in the product, and carry over 3 to the next place, that is, hundreds place. 7 multiplied by 5 equals 35. 35 plus 3 equals 38. Now write 38 in the product. Now add the both products. 0 plus 0 equals 0. 0 plus 0 equals 0. 4 plus 5 equals 9. 4 plus 8 equals 12. Write 2 in the sum and carry over 1 to next place. 3 plus 1 carry equals 4. 42,900 is a product of 550 and 78. So kids, we learned the column method of multiplication to multiply number with two digit number. Where we first multiply with the ones digit, then with the tens digit, and then Added both the products to get the answer. Kids, you need to do a lot of practice to be good at multiplication. Now go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.